James, Hi, good to see you, mate. Okay. Dwight, Joe. good you to right, see mate. you. So you're moving house? What? Yeah. Lady. Yeah. Mate, this is probably the last of the massive clubs with the old stadiums. This, this must hold some memories for you. I'm thinking, what about last year, last day of the season, the core rate to stay up? That must have been some pie. Oh, I mean, it wasn't really pies, it was like a relief. <laughs> yeah. Everyone yeah. just breathed finally yeah. for the end. Yeah, it was an amazing day. It was an amazing day. Not the position you wanted to be in, but uh, the feeling when that goal went in, I'm there for my kit. Um, I hope my missus don't watch this, I should be a, bit, <laughs> a little bit offended, but yeah, an amazing day. Making TV, boys. <laughs> Making TV. Go. I hope your driving's good. Yeah, so do I. Could have got up against that. I know. It's I not know. there, isn't it? <laughs> Second board. Like a movie, isn't it? Yeah. Trying to just go rogue and just go the wrong way and see what they do. See what they do, yeah. Wayne Bridge or something. <laughs> <laughs> Mate, I'm definitely not answering now. I don't know what he'll say. <laughs> right, boys. Big game at the weekend, I played in the derby. What I found was coming from London, coming to this place, like you, you if you was to win the game or lose the game, you, you can't hide. Like it's like everyone in this city is just football mad, aren't they? Yeah, yeah, everyone's they're passionate, are they about the club? And all the both clubs are they're close, aren't they? Yeah. So you can see that that row is there and we know it's like say every time it's the derby, it's, yeah. it's a massive game and to the game that you want to win. I feel like it's like their lives, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like some clubs may be a little bit different, you know, disrespect to them. I feel like if maybe there's a defeat there and you can sort of just go by and think it's yeah. not the way for the next game. I think here, yeah, you really represent the people and it really is their lives and it sort of yeah. makes up bricks. And, mm -hmm. and they let you know that, don't they? Do you know, when you sign for the club? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah rightfully so. Rightfully yeah. So. Last year was was a real, you know, you, you had Frank was in charge and you had the ownership group that was looking to sell. And I mean, it must have been tough. And being senior players, I mean, what, what got you through? What got you over the line? Because at one point it looked really, really precarious for you. Um, I think it sounds a bit cheesy, but the fans were incredible, I'll be yeah. honest. Yeah. For the position we were yeah. in, yeah. Yeah. the way they turn up, and you sort of representing us like we were fighting for a top four spot. You see the way the teams are playing in the league and we're fighting. The fan, our fans were incredible. Yeah. 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 That, I thought, yeah. that really brought us together as a, as a group as well, because it was tough times last season, very tough time. Yeah. Toughest time I've had in my career for sure. So um, I think the fans really galvanised us and we, we, we managed to pick up some massive points at the end of the season, which managed to save us. How was that for you, knowing your old boss is coming into town? No, obviously nobody likes to see the manager get sacked, but you know, it must have been comforting to know that right, he knows us, he knows what we can do. To see him again is such a, um, a short space of time. But no, it was good and he knew what he wanted yeah. already when when he came. So, And then when we had our son for the first game, that he managed at home and that's where it took off, really. You guys have played hundreds of games through him. Is he strict? Uh, is he, what's his style like? No, I, he's not strict. Like. Every gaffer has the ways, don't he? So yeah. he's quite strong in what what he believes in. Yeah. Um, but no, he knows how to get the the best out. But I think the word strict is probably a bit harsh. I think he's just it's a bit yeah. more old school than yeah. probably yeah. Um, more code managers, but just got his ways and ways and means. Yeah. Has he changed at all in the thing, or is he is he still very much in the, going falling back on the things that he likes to do? What, what? Um, he's, I think I reckon he's changed a little bit from yeah. that time. Yeah. Like um, one notable thing for me is I mean, he, we never used to wear white socks at training, and now we're allowed to wear white socks. So that's changed a little bit. Right, right. So he's sort of maybe <laughs> softened the touch. Um, but no, he's, he's very, he's very, he's, he's got his ways of mean in terms of like he, yeah. what he expects from the team, um, and I think it sort of suits the fans as well of what yeah. they expect: the hard work, and the dedication, the, the togetherness, the spirit, and they're all things which he, he wants from a team. Um, and it's what, it's what the fans expect as well. I've been at clubs when, when there's been ownership taking over and everything. It can be distracting and as senior players you feel that responsibility to, to keep the group going and keep keep the results positive. Yeah, yeah, we've got, like I said, we've got a few old lads who've got Tarps, who've got, yeah. who got Ash, who've got Shea. Yeah. Uh, you've got Pixie, you've got, got Lonners around the group, which is good to have them characters around. Especially for us young lads as well, especially when it go well one weekend. But we've got a good group, we've got, we've got a lot of talent in the group. And yeah. Definitely this year we want to push on and kick on and do a lot better than 
the last season. Hey, you're senior now, you played 100 yeah, exactly. games. I'm starting to yeah, play yeah. a young lad card anymore. <laughs> so you trying to get away with me? Yeah, I am, <laughs> technically, <laughs> my age. <laughs> young lad. <laughs> once, you, once you've played 150 uh, games now, you're, 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 you're a veteran. Acting That's like it. he just made his debut a few weeks ago. <laughs> Right, I open that. Open there, some cards in there. I think oh, I better not do it. Someone's driving. Oh, there we go. It's a, it's a little, uh, little few questions. The that, first one's the a director. The director's prepared for you, so don't blame me. <laughs> first well, question is: on. If you weren't a footballer, what would you yeah. be? I know That's what mine is. Mine. I always, really on, as a kid, I always used to say astronaut, but I don't know. Not because I didn't astronaut. Kind of see. Yeah, That's as a, a good kid, one, I you know. Just, or a pilot. I just had a thing about being in the air. I don't know why. Really? It's not like a skill for it. The way you do it. I'd say I'd be a, um, I love driving, so I'd be, I'd say I'd be a truck driver, you know. Truck driver. <laughs> I was going to say taxi driver. The taxi driver. <laughs> he's got, he's the taxi he's driver. I'm the cab driver. Here. Listen, so you've gone for astronaut and you've gone for truck driver. Yeah. Like, you've, you've shot, for, you've literally shot for the stars. <laughs> yeah, I've just gone for cabbie. <laughs> Best mate in the squad. Man, I'll be a few. The boys, I love right. it. I love it. What Fastest in the squad. Oh. Uh, the old J Jared's quick. Yeah, Jazz is yeah, quick. Jared yeah, yeah, he's yeah. really quick. Jazz is uh, quick. Then I said, that, yeah. Said, uh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, he's rapid. He doesn't look it. He's not really? like he's not okay. like. There's a few Ben. Yeah. Ben's quick. Yeah. Arnie Danjuba. Uh, yeah. Danjuba's quick. Yeah. yeah. I said them three top. Why's well, got the fastest arms? He's just his legs don't count. You, you, Victor, <laughs> always on to me. Why's well, got this run where he, his arms move really fast? <laughs> his actual <laughs> legs don't go anywhere. Uh. <laughs> It doesn't like a fake run. Can I ask you quickly, because I've, I've obviously been watching you play, and obviously Dominic Calvin lewis been so unfortunate with injuries, hasn't he? Yeah. But like, when he's in the team, you, you do look like you've got like, there's more impetus. What, what, is it, what is it that he brings to the team when he's fit? Yeah. I, think we, I think we play some strengths a lot and see yeah. him get a ball and so when we use him, he, he'll run behind, he'll hold the ball. Yeah. It's such a handful to play against. Yeah. I hate playing against him. Um, yeah, he's got everything. He's yeah. just, yeah, he's just class. so far. I hope he gets back yeah. to his, yeah. his best. Yeah. So, well, Crouchy is driving Virgil van Dijk around. So, um, any any messages for him, lads? Like, you know, any sort of Godfather-like messages? <laughs> 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 should have prepared a speech, should I? Yeah. You should have, yeah. <laughs> Watch yourself, Virgil, <laughs> I'll tell him. Yeah. The yeah. boys are coming for no. it. <laughs> We're ready to go. We're yeah. ready to go. We're ready to go. We're ready for it. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. It's massive, isn't it? Mate, do you know what? It's, it, it does look impressive. And yeah. they're telling me today this this wall here, that's the dock wall, so they have to yeah. keep that. Keep it. Like, so it looks like it's got that nice sort of old, yeah, old school, fashion. old school vibe, yeah. but with a with a new stadium in. It's massive, isn't it? It's class. Right, that's. How much is that? <laughs> <laughs> do you give me five star rating? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it took us about ten minutes. Like I know. Don't, minutes. Yeah, I'm definitely not getting a five star rating. <laughs> Two missed turns. Come on, let's go and see the stadium. Oh. It is uh, massive, isn't it? Is. You're going to love this boys, honestly. Mm -hmm. I feel like I'm Dion Dublin now. <laughs> Home's under the hammers. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not aware that he's on Saturday. The goal with the outfit. Oh, I'll leave it out. <laughs> you look amazing. <laughs> I thought I'd bomb the builder. It's kind of weird. There we go. I'm excited. Ready to go. Okay. Here we are boys, it looks amazing. Can you envision yourselves running out here? What would it be like? It'd be incredible when he's finally done it. I mean, it's looking amazing now and to imagine there's going to be a football pitch on there and it's going to be packed out full of, full of toffee fans uh, and it'd be exciting. Hopefully me and Dwight are still here ready to, ready to play around to this pitch. This is where you want to play, don't you, in the, be the best stadiums and I think this will be one of the best ones in, in the Premier League to, to play at. Definitely, and just want to, like I say, it's nearly done and just want to get it done so you can get, get playing on there. I think if we can keep that atmosphere from Goodison and bring it to here, and we can really create something special and it's looking incredible. And as I say, we'll, we'll, once it's packed out of Everton fans, um, it will, will be a special time for the club here. Thanks very much. Thanks very much. Nice to meet you.